All right, hi guys, I'm back. It's make video days. Um, I was actually outside, if you can hear me, um, getting my backyard ready. I'm having an epic Halloween party this year, because why not, right? Uh, world's too boring and too unhappy, so celebrate. Um, and I am in my backyard, right, which I rarely ever come in, and um, I am getting this space ready, and I'm realizing there's this big pile of, of hose here that's like all mangled. And this, this spout has literally been on for like five minutes and I was going to clean everything off, but no water is coming out. Hmm, interesting. So I thought this would be a great video on how we get blocked and stuck in life when we think that there's no water coming out, there's no money coming out, there's no help, there's no people, there's no right guy or right girl. Oh God, this water's gonna come out soon, hopefully. Um, anyways. And this is what happens to our bodies when our energy is blocked. I just made another video about um, the lights and the illumination and the masculine and feminine energy. So hopefully check that one out. But this one is all about like demonstration of what it's like to be blocked in your body and manifest, right? Lack of money, lack of time, lack of health, lack of people, lack of investors, lack of clients, right? And what happens and why. So basically if you have to look at you, as this right so the hose would be your body okay the water that's turned on at the source right over there is the source of the water and it's flowing which means that when this thing starts to to go it's going to shoot out like a fire hose so my job is to unentangle this mess so you're never blocked you guys you're never stuck you're never not able to manifest money or time or health or the right people or places. Your energy is blocked, that's it. Because you are literally a manifest manifestation powerhouse. Your entire system was designed to turn desire into physical reality. The water that should be coming out of here should be your abundance, right? Your playmates, your opportunities, your adventure, your trips, your clients, everything you need should be coming out of here if this was not tangled. But I haven't been out here in like a year, well, maybe six months, and this is completely tangled and it's hardened, right? So I'll show you, right? One of these is like completely like, and each one of these represent, right? Trauma, pain, um, chemical toxicity in the body, right? Um, rejection, abandonment, that's what bends your hose. And when these hoses bend, we have this like subconscious like stop like ooh, i don't want to fail again i don't want to get hurt again i don't want to suffer again i don't you know want to get sick again and really the body internally does not know that you're a new person in a new place and a year later you know you want to have a party it does not know that it just knows that we are stuck and blocked so what i have to do now is turn off that hose for a minute and i have to manually go unkink these hoses now, a lot of times you think that your meditations should unkink everything. It's really not enough because your life has to be a meditation, which means that I have to look at each kink. Okay, what would I be believing, thinking, or feeling to stop the flow of my own money line, right? Oh, you know, money is my birthright. I'm supposed to have what I need, or so the books tell me. How come I cannot manifest what I need, right? So again, that water is raging through. That abundance is backing up right now in this hose and it's pressuring you and you can feel that like, oh, it's like it wants to break through the dam, but the energy is blocked and that is coming usually from trauma and pain and emotional, chemical or physical trauma, stuck points, not happening outside, happening inside this hose, right? Because the water, the money, the abundance, the people, places and things that you need to live out your heart's desire are, are it's literally on you can hear it but it is not now we're at 10 minutes almost and there's no water coming out so you can see what you think you need to do is take more action you need to work harder get a better job you know get overtime you know date five more people that is not going to change the energy flow actually it's going to be the opposite because of this blockage point it the filters that you see here and experience life with are also blocked so you keep proving yourself outside that that people are, are rejecting you and they're abandoning you, 
because you're experiencing it on the inside and your filters are received through thoughts, perceived through the brain, the subconscious activates chemical reactions called hormones, and you believe people are rejecting and abandoning you, but this is what's happening inside your field. So in quantum fitness, we are manually popping this hose open and then like a fire hose, this water is going to take care of my yard and get it all ready. Plus then it will get like nice and neat and it'll be presentable. So hopefully that helped to understand that you're never blocked, that this is blocked because that water is on. You can even see if you look down there that the water is like trying to pull out. The universe is nothing but abundance, guys. That's all it is. So if it's not coming out and through and to you, that's what's happening.